And once you and I go into business, we own and operate at least the businesses in our community, what we will be doing is developing a situation wherein we will actually be able to create employment for the people in the community. My name is John Cook. I'm the founder and executive director of a nonprofit organization called Really Living Corporation. We provide various support services for the terminally and chronically ill, such as free transportation and medical treatments, prescription assistance, and emergency monetary assistance. I am intimately acquainted with the needs of the terminally and chronically ill. I was a dialysis patient for over 20 years until I received a kidney transplant last year. And that's the reason that I founded the organization, and I'm very passionate about helping those who are less fortunate. And your business tip for another business owner is? Uh, actually, I've gotten a lot of questions about uh, how people could start something similar, and, and my advice is to just start. Uh, any hospital that you go to, any dialysis clinic, any place that offers chemotherapy, I guarantee that there's a person who's too tired to be uh, Who's too tired to drive to and from treatment or doesn't have transportation uh, to, uh, to get to their treatment. So my, my advice if someone wants to do something similar is to just start. Once you change your philosophy, you change your thought pattern. Once you change your thought pattern, you change your, your attitude. Once you change your attitude, it changes your behavior pattern. And then you go on into some action. As long as you got a sit-down philosophy, you'll have a sit-down thought pattern. And as long as you think that old sit-down thought, you'll be uh, in some kind of sit-down everywhere. <laughs>